Hey, what up guys? It's your mama, Mr. Puma. I'm giving you guys a special commentary because, yeah, guys, I just reached 200 subs. And today we're going to do the girl phobia. Um, it's kind of like a little trailer where I'm going to listen to Girl Gone Gamer. If you guys don't know who she is, she's a famous YouTuber that's like a vlogger slash gamer. And she talks about, you know, tips on life, mostly like about like girls, relationships with them. So today we're going to listen to, to a commentary of hers of hers talking about shyness and I'm gonna respond to that all right so I hope you guys enjoy let's see how she says what she says oh look at that intro play 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 every day hey guys, ah, no, just kidding Sharks guys just, just kidding I, mean. the <laughs> I wanted to ask you guys if you think it's time for a new intro oh I yeah it's you need a new intro half, definitely I for a fresh one i know how much you guys love the song so i don't like the song the and just have different graphics yeah, so don't tell me i like the one, song was interested contact me Jesus. On so we can talk but anyways today i'm gonna be talking about being shy in relationships Thank you. and i've done a Jeez. lot of different types of relationship advice fox? commentaries and vlogs and one thing i get a lot in the comments is well what do i do if i'm shy i maybe i'm i'm too okay, shy turtle, to take this on, advice man. or i'm too shy mm -hmm. to do that some not people that little find or just going up to a stranger no turtles, and they find that terrifying like if it's Jesus. something they think is really good looking or something they are maybe cool with their friends and they're not too shy with them but when it comes to meeting new people they might find that really really scary and i know how that is uh, I mean, that, that is definitely true i'm sure it's not easy mm -mm. just randomly that's what i'm here for baby Teach me, be, so be my teacher, baby. It's just kind of a personal thing, but today I'm going to be giving advice for those of you that are maybe a little bit too shy to take the like you just said that. Dang. dating advice Get or going on up to with a girl the advice tips. and things like that. So things like that. The first thing I'd say to do is approach more girls. And I'm not oh, necessarily talking about really? I gotta... It doesn't have to even have to be girls that you're really interested in. Just going up so to ugly girls. girls, talking oh, to them. I don't, I don't want pretty girls. I don't want no ugly girls. Talk, striking up a conversation. Just getting comfortable with the idea of talking right. to people of the opposite sex that you don't know. It's going to get you more comfortable so that when you're ready for to go up to someone that you I'm actually like, dick. so that you I find mean, attractive I'm, that you I'm ready for anything. Out, you'll be a lot more confident. So just... All right, so... That tip there, she was talking about like talking to more girls, feeling you know the atmosphere of talking to more girls, getting comfortable with the situation. I mean, I could see me doing that, just approaching more. Like sometimes when I approach a girl, I like overthink things. Like, what if she thinks I'm weird? I mean, I gotta overcome that. So in order to do that, you know, my confidence level has to be up. And you know, just approach them. Who cares what people think? Just do what I gotta do. You know, you know to. Do what I gotta do. So, push my girls. Thank you. My next, All right, next advice tip. would be to do more social things like parties, clubs, things like parties. that. Parties. You don't have to be the life of the party. I'm not saying. Oh, to okay. Yeah, I was right. When I, if I'm in the life of the party, I'd go crazy. I'd like, be like that. Get on the dance floor, but dancer. you know, just be open with people. Smile. Open. No, go open to like my the, legs. Where the snacks are, <laughs> where the DJ is, where there's like a group of people, and just start talking to people and stuff like that. It's easier to meet oh, when there's a okay. lot of people around you. It's not just like a dinner or something with three or four close friends, and maybe you don't know a few of them. That can get kind of awkward. And I can see where someone who's really shy would have a problem. But if you're ah, a party, okay. you know, the conversation can be really light you can make jokes the music's probably playing you don't have to worry about other people hearing you mm. and when you get into a club or a party or something there's so many people and you really have so many options about who you want to talk to and things like that oh that is definitely true so she's suggesting go in the surrounding area with like different people so you get like the feel of like you not like the only one there because that's what i have a problem like if i usually want to talk to somebody it's usually when like I want to be with somebody else, so like I tell my friend to come with me, so I like, don't feel like that nervous, and like I don't know, because sometimes I don't know how to c continue like the conversation in my past history with the girls, so I'll just like tell someone like just to come with me, or to help me, like I'll um, tell them. Oh, how are you gonna interrupt me? But yeah, <laughs> God, to the girl dang. Like, and I'm not saying go up to a girl and be like, hey, how are you doing? My name is John, and I'm shy. I'm just Hi, my name is. Uh, well, you telling me? Nah, nah, nah I, I ain't, ain't doing like, that. I. I've heard that if you do that, telling a girl that they're shy, that it just lowers down your confidence. I mean, no, that it shows them that you don't have a strong level of confidence, which is a huge, huge turn off. So I've researched that and I am definitely not doing that. Actually, one time my friend told a girl that that was that he was shy and then she was like, 
totally off his balls. So I ain't doing that. Sorry, GGG. I mean, that's kind of psycho. Shy. And so yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Do, try and relax. You know, sometimes people who are really shy get like sweaty hands or they okay, shake. Okay, I don't get sweaty. They just don't know what to do. I remember reading this article about this guy who was so shy that he actually put his armor on this girl, and okay. then he was so afraid to move it even an inch. That when the movie ended or wherever they were, it fell asleep and she like he like accidentally slapped her in the face with the arms. So, you know, just remember. <laughs> That's not even funny. Like as an idiot. Okay, things are. I'm I'm really getting shy. I'm really okay, nervous I'm... about this. Try to take deep breaths. Relax. Be calm. <sighs> Don't think. People. I've noticed with a lot of shy people, and I actually do this too because I'm kind of shy sometimes. Is you overthink things. You'd be like, well, if I do this, she might think this. Or, hey, that's what that. I just it'll said. Remember, I was like, I overthink Try things. Not to overthink everything you do. That's like the worst thing you can ever do. Oh, is overthinking good, 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 thing good tip, do. good so tip, girl. Get really, really awkward. Awkward. For what you want to do once that you're already maybe is me ask right that there. person. I create out. awkwardness. A movie is always a good idea. Dinner's probably not the best idea. Well, uh, dinner, for a first I mean, date if you're a shy person because I don't, I don't eat chicken for dinner so that would be you know, you know you're eating and you don't know whether to talk while you're eating or just not talk and so a movie talk gives you chicken. a lot of conversation to talk about after you know you can talk about the movie did you like it did you not like it and not only that for the most mm, part movie. Day, which is the actual right. movie you can just sit back and relax and enjoy it so um those are that's the advice i have for shy people all right oh th thanks girl thank thank you girl gone gamer so what i realized so all these tips, you know, talking to more girls that I don't know, going to parties or a group of people, and then oh, after that I'm not gonna tell them I'm shy, but don't be nervous. I mean, this could gave me a great tip for girl phobia, but I'm not gonna tell you guys. I mean, not a not a tip, but everything that I'm gonna do for girl phobia to end this series. So I'm not gonna tell you guys. I'm not gonna even tell my friends at school. This is gonna be epic. I know. What I'm gonna do, guys. So thank you, GGG, and stay tuned for Girlphobia Part Four for the 200 subscribers celebration. All right, peace out.